There is a fascinating fringe movement in American politics that is coming to be known as the birthers. They are people who believe that Barack Obama is not really American, that he was born outside the United States and that he is therefore not technically really president. Among their ranks is the conservative political activist and frequent and enthusiastic loser of elections, the great Alan Keyes. Is he president of the United States? According to the Constitution, in order to be eligible for president, you have to be a natural born citizen. Uh, he has refused to provide proof that he is in fact a natural born citizen. Except for the birth certificate that he provided that shows he was born in Hawaii. Oh, but that's beside the point, right? As is often the case with wacky groups formed to champion exciting but fact-challenged conspiratorial causes, the birthers are in the middle of a melodramatic internal feud. Their East Coast leader, Philip Berg, is now suing their West Coast leader, Orly Tates, I guess is how you say her name, it's T-A-I-T-Z. The accusations include charges of libel and of Tates calling Mr. Berg a, quote, shyster. And I'm guessing no one was quoting Shakespeare. I'm not going to get in the middle of this civil war, but my guess is that no matter which party is in the right here, the losing side will never admit that he or she was wrong, despite mountains and mountains and mountains of evidence to the contrary. Just a guess. And